Hello everybody, welcome back to the Gun Squad Challenge. If you're wondering why I'm kind of laughing slash a little bit ticked off right now, is because I just tried recording this twice the first time. Well, I can kind of show you here. But we're going to be taking the rest of Hogshead possibly in this video. But the first turn relies on me being decent with a mortar. The first one I just completely not only missed. The second recording, which just happened less than a minute ago. The airship got in the way. And it was going to be a perfect shot. And like an idiot, I didn't even look where I placed the mortar. So. Yeah, doing good already. already. <laughs> I've been recording this for half an hour. And yeah, I did this in practice in the first try. Maybe I shouldn't even practice. Maybe I should just go for it. No. Because I don't. I know you guys don't want to see an entire episode of Fairway. It's not fun watching someone fail repeatedly, repeatedly and just getting mad. Especially in this game, it's all on you most of the time. Like, like rage games, yeah, they're funny to watch. But in a game like this, where it's completely and utterly down on the you, no luck hardly at all, it's really annoying. So we're gonna grab the motor, we're gonna grab the helicopter, gonna scream at that airship up there, screw you. And that probably just ran me out of time, but you know, screw the airship. And now we're gonna run over here. We got the health kit so we can survive a couple of more beers. And the mortars are so hard to trash. Which is annoying because I have to get at least 45 damage on this guy. There we go. Now I can officially have an actual recording of this mission. Oh, wait, wait. Pretty good shot. Mike's going to be distracting Detsky for a while. Alright, now we're going to run on over here. And my eye itches, which is a whole the time. And now I got fingers. Finger smudge on glasses, good. Oh, glasses. The most enjoyable thing in the world, also known as a pain in my butt. Now we're gonna see if I can get this to work. Go back in the water. Okay. Because I want this guy to kill me. But, not on this first immediate go. Okay. We want to try and kill him with our explosion. So if I position correctly, he should shoot snow ski instead of us. And I gotta readjust my glasses. That should be right. As long as it doesn't hit both of us, because I know it can do that too. Okay, there we go. If we've done that correctly, we can kill him with our own explosion. Actually, where am I going? There's no need to go over there with you. Because we can hit him from here. Mm, yep. There we go. There's two of the bomb down. there. Yeah, we want to take care of them first because mortars are very... Very dangerous in this game. Especially for our little 25 HP thingy. Now if we've done this right, he'll go in the water. If we've done this wrong, we just lost pig. But, well, we're gonna lose pigs anyways. The mission's not impossible. There we go. And that was the aim of that. We sacrifice one for a kill. Now we want to pretty much distract that other guy as well. I mean, we can attempt the kill. And I, I didn't do any testing to see if we could get to the airburst. I think we might have enough time to get to the airburst, but I don't think you'd have enough time to actually line up a shot. 
I like I said, like I just said, I don't know if you actually do have enough time. I haven't been able to test that because, well, this is actually a very easy mission. The hope here is that we can land them on a mine. If we can do that, it'll kill them. Nope, didn't move anywhere. Well, that's a bit annoying. We'll probably lose one more peg then, but not a whole load we can do on that. Am I going right? Because we're gonna lose one either way, just about. But we're gonna grab this health kit. Now we're gonna grab the air, the rifle burst over here. Which is the, I think this is the only time I've actually used the rifle burst. It's a good weapon, but it's just so annoying to use. And now with a bit of finesse and some luck here, we can make this one. Actually, that was pretty easy. Now lined up just right, and, you can, and we need to hit three shots on him. There we go. One pig left. I didn't feel a thing. That's what everyone says. And if one of my good dog got hushed, he's been bugging this entire video, hasn't she? Alright. He might die just because he might go in the water. Oh no. Okay. And we're back to Mike. And I'm not gonna take any risks, so we're gonna get a lot closer so I can just use like an edge straight up in his face. And I was a little worried there because I wasn't looking at the screen, so I thought I was gonna actually go in the water and kill Mike. The real annoying part about jumping is that there's actually a delay to it. You can't do it immediately every time when you're low HP like this. No, I'm not gonna use a mortar because I. Guarantee you I won't kill him. Unless we do a suicide shot, which wouldn't be worth it. There we go. That was what's supposed to happen the first turn, but no. There we go. Mission four. Not that difficult. Who knows why it was? Because we did have to sacrifice one to get one. But we'll take it. And I still have the hiccups. I've had them for half an hour. <sighs> and my dog's still barking. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> and now, right on to Island Invasion. This one also not that hard. Surprisingly enough. The first mission that I have had trouble with is the next one, actually. The first mission of South Australia. That one, I'm not going to be following the strategy of which Fly ODB did. Why? Because I just cannot pull it off. Oh, I'll tell you about it next time. Because right now we have Island Invasion to take on. And yeah, this mission is pretty easy. Because I think I've showed this off before, but one, we're going to let him take care of himself. We're pretty much going to use the computer to kill two of the own pigs. And the sniper, actually there's a pretty easy way to negate him. Well, not negate them, but use them. Now, what the dude did in the video, he he passed it against that hill next to him, but I'm just gonna throw this straight over the hill. My only pleasure is your awful there we go. So he's practically dead. Okay, I was about to say, really? You're not gonna go for it? I've never seen you do that before. And this is pretty much the only way I've ever seen them use the witch in the mine. Okay. <laughs> I've never seen him do that before, but that works too. 
<laughs> what? That, that's good either. Although, once again, yeah, we're going to sacrifice Shenley. I'm the only kind of female on the team, and we're just gonna use her as a dummy, I guess. Because this medic, we don't like him. He's stupid. He has too much hair. See that one on his chest there? Good, because I don't see him either. But either way, we're gonna stand all right face to face with him. We're gonna kill this guy, because this guy's ugly. No one likes monkeys. Alright, now that he's out of the picture, the other bombardier shall do the job for us, most likely. Because for some reason, they don't really like moving a whole lot here, so instead of getting a clean pistol shot, he's gonna mortar both of us. I'll still almost never understand that one. I mean, I understand it, but it's ridiculous. <laughs> and there you go. We lose one. But he killed his own medic. If only that was true. Ah. Now it's the sniper's turn because he's the only other one left besides the one that just killed his own teammate. Now the deal here is there's three health kits on the map. This pig is getting all of them. I know a fourth one does come down eventually, but what we honestly, I think we beat the mission before that health kit even comes down. But we're gonna grab all the health kits and we're going to attack that guy on the island. Well, the bombardier. I'll, I know that was a little strange though because these are all islands, so. We're gonna attack the bombardier. And the reason we're getting all the health kits with this guy is because now he has 85 HP because we'll have two sniper rifles. And we don't need a perfect shot here with this, we just need to get some damage. This is really just to do anything with this pig. Yeah, 26, that's pretty good. Could have maybe gotten 30 if I got a little bit closer, but going a little further on that is a risky. Because you kind of want this guy in a very specific spot, so you can hit him. And that's the spot. He'll go up here and just snipe the dude with 85 HP. I have no in my abilities, because, the AI, because the computer has a very good tendency to aim at pigs with high health. Alright, now Kyle's gonna attack him. Actually, no. Kyle's going. Actually, no, it's Kyle. Who is it? It's Kyle. I was gonna lose all his HP because I'm bad at that drum. But we're gonna go on over here. And we're going to get in a shelter to distract this guy. So we don't have to worry about mortars. We can kill him, but we don't want the sniper to have too many turns. And there we go. And now this does also give us a free turn. There we have. There we go to that. Now, Abby. You are going to... Well, you're going to attack, but you're also going to hide. Alright. If this is the right spot, we should be able to get a full grenade damage on Four grenade damage, four grenade. Oh yeah, ah, 29. Now well, we can still kill him easily. Just now the hope is he shoots at the guy with the 45 HP. He aims at Obby. Okay. Obby, you probably get poison, but you probably won't die because we'll end the mission before you get another go. Well, that was an awkward bounce. But you are now going to die if we don't do it fast enough. But it's not that, not that hard. Because now we're going to go over here and do some island hopping. And there we go. We're now on his island. Because his island's actually pretty big. Hey. Hey. I can hear 
there's news in the background. Whoops. That's why I get a scratch in the back of my head while I'm playing. And because I want to finally grab this, is, I want to grab this crate when it drops down for no reason, mind you, no reason at all. I don't actually have to grab this crate at all. I just want to grab the crate. And I probably missed it anyways. There we go. Only one enemy left. And Mike is shouldn't be that low on HP, but I'm bad at games. Oh, come on. I'm so bad at grabbing that crate. I don't think I, I've used it like once. And that was on like the first episode of the series. Or like the second episode. Isn't it? Alright. Now we're gonna move you on over there and kill. Okay. And that is the mission. There we go. We have conquered Hogshead with this last rifle round. And like I said, I'm not going to be doing the next mission in this episode as well. Because mission 6 takes a... I could use a little more practice. I, and I can do it. But where I'm at right now, it comes down to more luck than I'd like to have in a video. Because mission 24 is painful enough with the luck, so if I can eliminate as much luck as I can, I'm going to. And skip the cutscene, because I, cause we've all seen this at least once, just about. But there we go, Hogshead Falls, Enemy Stalks, the Daily Squeaker. Squeal, oink, gunt, oink, gunt, oink, 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 squat, oink, squeal. And we have 12 medals, boy. Alright, and with that, we're gonna look at that kill and battle count. Mike, on nine missions, six kills. It's kinda sad, dude. Shenzi, with nine missions, ten kills. Not bad. And Bubba, 14 missions, 19 kills. Pretty good. Honestly, I, honestly, I didn't think we'd have this long with a survival pick. <laughs> I know it's the second incarnation of Bubba. I know it is. You know, honestly, let's see if I can now on button let's see if we can add more onto that name or well, if that's the max number oh no we can okay just to make sure there we go it's a bubble too and kyle 10 missions five kills not bad not bad and lobby 13 missions five kills well you're lacking the kills but at least they're surviving Either way, though, I hope you guys enjoyed that episode. And when we come back next time, we'll be doing Under Siege and Communication Breakdown. Yeah, a lot of fun those missions are. <laughs> well, Mission 6 is bad. Mission 7 should be too good. Not too bad. Either way, though, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I will see you later. Have a good day.